Hello there, Internet. My name is White Dragons, and we're going to be doing a new Let's Play called Blind Let's Play. I basically find a mod pack from either Feed the Beast, Tech Launcher, or from Curse Client, and we play it until it either breaks or we die in hardcore questing. This mod pack comes from the Feed the Beast launcher. It is called the Ferret Business. I uh, watched about five minutes of it and said, okay, I'll try it. Uh, I love the homepage, it's pretty nice. I've adjusted it a little bit, I've adjusted sound and everything else like that. Again, as always, if you hear the sound of a f fan in the background, that's because it's Florida and it's hot. And I'm not going to sweat to death while making videos. So there you go. So uh, the front page has updating from 0.0.8. Point one or earlier, you will need to delete your HQM questing progress. Please click the troubleshooting. Blah blah blah. I love this homepage. It's really awesome. So we're gonna get started. There was uh, there was one thing it said that we were that we needed to do, and that was we needed to make sure make sure that's on that. We needed to make sure we set it on biomes of plenty. That was the instructions that were given to us on the website, so that is what we're going to use. Uh, I always turn cheats on just in case there's an issue. We can always get it fixed ASAP. And we're going to put in White Dragons is. Uh, you know what? I have a video. Blind. Let's play. There we go. Alright. And this will be the Blind Let's Play. Fine. Let's. Uh, my fingers don't want to work. Let's play. There we go. Screw it. I'm going with that. So, I have no idea what to expect. I have no idea to know what's going on. I apologize if my voice sounds in and out, but that's the way my keyboard is. I'll try to get closer, just for you, so that that way you can hear perfectly. Actually. I'm so I might back a little bit and get it just a wee bit closer for you. How about that? Sound fair? Sounds fair. Probably going to crap in production, but I'll fix that, hopefully. So, come on, world generate. So if you ever play with these packs, the first thing that I always give tips on is let the world generate first before you actually start participating in it. And what I mean by that is, is when the world comes up, hit the escape button. And, uh... I had problems loading this one, uh, the the mod pack itself. I had problems loading it. So if this doesn't work, then oh, it worked. There we go. Okay. So as you can see, the world is loading, and my uh, I, I'm trying to find uh, ones that are mod packs that don't spike out your computer, but make you know that you can play on an older computer because I I do have a five year old computer, so you know there is that. So I think the sh there's Thomacon in here. Okay. We need to go ahead and fix something right now, which is Tells Editor. What the hell is that? Which is <clears throat> a Journey Map. Journey Map seems to have this thing where it kind of screws with you. Uh, an able mini map. Show pets. We don't need to show pets. We need to show villagers. We don't need to show animals, show grind, show grid, oh grid, can't read, uh, animal, uh, players heading yes, show waypoint labels yes, biomes, um, I don't need that, show location, show players, there's only one person, that's me, um, show caves, let's turn that off, show mob heading, show crosshairs on the minimap, I don't need that. Small icons, small icons on the map, don't need that. Show compass, show mobs, show shelf, show shelf, yes, show shelf. Uh, and we're going to change it to, a squ I like square, square's pretty good. And then the size, I'm actually going to go ahead and reduce it down to, I think, 20, just to be on the safe side. And I think that'll help us out a lot. These are the people that create, I think, uh... That helped, uh, oh gosh, I can't remember. They they helped in Journey Map. F3 and F, Shift F3, Journey Map Performance Data. 
Oh, okay, cool. New city. Okay, what's new? All right, awesome. All right, so that will take care of that. So let's try this again. Oh, God, yes, that makes it so much better. I don't know why. Oh, my God, I got, like, a crap ton of books. Oh, God. Okay. Okay, thank you, thank you. I don't want to attract those guys, please. Please. Please, Scooby. Okay, hold on. I'm doing this because you guys need to see what I'm doing. Minimal. There we go. Done. Done. Boom. Okay. So we've got uh, materials in you. We've got encyclopedia. Aura? Quests. Tablets. What the hell is that? That's a person. Is that a person? No, that's a monster. That's a freaking monster. It made a noise. It's making a noise. Okay. Let's uh let's go up here real quick. I don't want to deal with that. Thank you very much. Have a nice day. I don't think hunger overhauls in this one, thank God. Uh this is this will be okay for now. Uh we've got a book. What the hell is okay. The ferret business guide. Sneak to open in edit mode. Auto saves when you close the GUI. Sushi. Oh, we got sushi. That's pretty cool. And he gave us a piece of string. Okay, we got that. And there's our compass. Alright, so where's the sun at? Sun is... Oh, oh ooh. Well, that's not supposed to be there. That's a, I turned off clouds. Alright, so let's open this up. Open up. Hello? Hello? Is this... Yes, Skittles. I see the flashing light. No, Skittles, don't touch I said don't touch that. Oh, wait. That worked. Good job, Assistant Skittles. <laughs> uh, greetings, Assistant. Uh, your name, uh, I have it here somewhere. I'm going to give you a nickname. Bandit. A classic Bert nickname, I believe. Uh, yes, right. You are the lucky survivor of our latest technological achievement. Multidimensional teleportation. Our scientists have been working on this for ages. We lost more than a few personnel and labs getting this perfected and... What? Oh, right. My name is Kagan. I am the CEO of the ferret business. We buy, sell, acquire, stockpile, and we search anything and everything we can. I know you are a new kid to the family, but I can already see the potential in you. We have no clue at all where you are. Hell, you may have even landed some of the other test sub... I mean, assistants. You hold another great invention from the ferret business. The questionable universal exploration and study transmitter. Our quest tablet. Well, it's more like an e-reader, really, with a built-in miniature teleportation apparatus. It has built-in scanners and a database, and, well, we tried to teleport you home with it, but something is preventing us. We're not sure what. But I feel that, right now, we have an amazing opportunity. Right now, you are potentially one of our greatest assets. Well, if you can prove it. We currently have no idea if the place you ended up is worth investing in. We're already getting a lot of data from your Quest tablet scanner, some of them very familiar and others very alien. Using your tablet, you can send us materials and aid in our research of this new world, and in return you will be paid and can use the corporate shop to purchase things to help you survive until we can get you home. So, are you ready, Assistant Bandit of the Ferret Business? Let's get started. Okay, so that was different. Let's get started. So we have four quests in total. We are not in hardcore mode, thank God. Uh, because uh, the, just by looking at the monster, we have issues already. Uh, we have a reputation. We have job, new assistant, uh, shop loyalty, and trade rank opportunist. Interesting. Uh, let's go ahead and get started. Let's see. We have initial research. We have general store. And we have production contracts. Okay. Interesting. Interesting deed. First things first, we need to find ourselves a place of living. Because I don't really like this at all. Um, typically for survival worlds, I kind of run somewhere where there's a lot of wood. And we are near the woods, of course. Uh, there's water. What the hell is all that out there? Uh, so that's good. We got willows. That's awesome. Uh, and we will be chunk loading things, so if we slow down a little bit, there's a good reason why. Um, 
So we're just going to look here. I like staying near the water because we can go fishing pretty easily. There's a wisp, which more thumbcraft. <gasps> oh, oh, yeah. Now that's what I'm talking about. Of course, I generated this world. You saw it. So it looks like we've got ourselves a dungeon. Of course, I have no armor. So I have... Shut up, sheep. I have no idea what to expect in here. Um. Oh, yeah, this is great. This is good, because there could be a chest up top, which will totally help us. Super duper duper help us. Um, so, like I said before, we're going to play this mod pack until it breaks, or till we get bored with it. So, I think that sounds fair. I'm trying to listen for anything. Mm, nope, you're not coming in through there. Let's check up here. It's pure sunlight. Oh, there's some flint. Damn. No chest. Ain't that something. Oh well. This is a good start at least. We have somewhere to, you know, get cooped up for the night at least. I hear chickens. I don't know where the hell they're at. Chicken! Where are you at? Nope. Not over there. Chicken! Chicken be safe. I don't know what the hell's out here. <gasps> Chicken! Oh, you... Shit, that won't work. You know how to get out of that, don't you? <gasps> Chicken, no! It'll be okay. He'll come back. They always come back. I love you, chicken. You'll probably be my next meal. Until the, well, until the sushi runs out, that is. Ooh, there's a whole bunch of chickens. I hear multiple chickens. What the hell? Alright, let's get this place on lockdown. I have no idea what to expect as far as monsters are concerned. So we're just going to lock this place down. And uh, for all hopes and giggles, let's put a torch here. Get this all tuckered away. I have no idea how this world plays as far as spawns go. Because, um, again, I did not do any research. I, this is just a blind play. Let's play. So there you go. Uh, no, I'm not going to have that. And we'll put one right there for safety. All right, so I know there's a dungeon down there. I'm not really concerned about that. Uh, we may have monsters that can come through there. So let's take our dirt. Okay, that was weird. I heard, thought I heard something. Let's go ahead and fill in the holes so nothing can get inside. Okay, nothing can get inside. We are good. I've been playing obscurity, and I'm freaking cautious as hell now, days, about everything. Okay, that's good, that's good. We got water right here. Will I fall and take damage? Yes, okay. Shut up, chicken. Alright. We got a berry bush, that's awesome. Alright, let's grab, oh, we got some berries too, even better. Sweet. This chicken's falling out of the sky now. What the hell? Alright, let's get this and then let's get some wood. Because Gina gotta get wood. That's what Minecraft is. Get wood. Punch tree. Yay! Oh god. Right in my face. Come on. So I don't know if this is gonna require us to go different places. But, like, those clouds are not really clouds. I'll tell you that right now, because, like I said, I've turned off clouds, so I don't know what the hell that is. Um, so we'll see. Uh, they did get some compass, which is pretty awesome. You know, beating the hell out of it with a, you know, to get wood. Who knows? We'll also take a look on, to see what, uh, mods we have in here as well. So the first episode's gonna be kind of like this, guys, so just, you know, be mindful of that, and, you know... And, just sit back, relax, and enjoy my voice. So, I always play these first couple episodes like this, and t then I'll start cutting stuff out. Um, unless you don't want me to. If you don't want me to, then I'll not cut anything out. I'll leave everything in here whole. Um, so, we'll see. We'll see. 
I uh, don't see a lot of different things. I like decreasing the minimap because it does help with the frame rate. So, there's a quick tip for you. Shut up, chicken. The hell? You okay? You need a tic tac? Bro? You okay? You take Mandarin? You like Mandarin? Huh? No? You don't like Mandarin? You got. You. Are you. Do you not? Oh, is that a rubber tree? That's a rubber tree. I've not seen those in a long time. Okay, I'm so happy. All right. Oh, look at that. You can tap into them, too. That's so awesome. All right, let's get inside. Chicken, do you want to come inside with me? No? You sure, chicken? Maybe your only chance of survival, buddy. Okay. All right, so let's get upstairs. Okay. And the chicken's on his own. I asked him if he wanted to come up here. He said, he, you heard him. He said, buck, 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 buck. So we're going to go with no. All right, so there's only, is there any one way? Yeah, there's one way in, which will be right here. But I think there's a platform right here. Yeah. So the spider can't crawl up there. The only thing we got left to do is place a torch here and a torch here. And that should be plenty of room. Plenty of light. Uh, and like I said, the only area that they could possibly get us is through here. So I'm not really worried about that much. Okay. Chicken, how the hell did you get in here? Are you magic? Seriously, how did you get in here? Because that means baby zombies can get in here. Seriously, how did you get in here? You are magic. Good job, chicken. What? Where'd he go? He disappeared again. I don't like this. This smells like doom. For me. There we go. Okay. I don't know how, chicken, how that chicken got in here, but... God bless him. God bless him. All right, so let's open this up and see. Initial research. So we have the ferret business uh, repeatable quest, three days and zero hours. Uh, this guidebook will help you understand the basics of the mod pack and give you a handy catalog. You can get a new copy every few Minecraft days. Uh, it must cost something. So we need to turn in... Oh, okay, so we if we need it again, we just put a, give them a charcoal, and then we can get the ferrets thing. Okay, cool. Soil sample. Uh-oh, there you, oh, 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 there you go, R. Good, good, is good. Uh, wait, hold on, how, what the hell am I saying? Uh, how can I, I'm trying to read this just a wee bit. Oh, oh, there you are, good, it is good. This is working good. I'm a biologist, Bitsy. The Quest tablet scanner shows that your place is big. Big, big, yes. This is good. Can you grab me a few samples of dirt and sand and gravel and stuff? Stuff is good. You can use your mitts to gather the basic stuff to start with. Okay, and then they'll give us a silver coin, field hatchet, field pickaxe, an apple. We need one, 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 one. Okay. Uh, general store. General store. It's not there. Uh, production contracts. Nothing's there. Hmm. Okay. And all these are locked. Alrighty. So with that being said, let's open the ferret's business guide. Uh, welcome to the ferret's business. A mod pack created by me. The author's name. The basic premise of the mod pack is free form. It is up to you what you want to do. I have provided an HQM quest book called the Quest Tablet, which provides a multitude of quests that help explain how to use the various mods within the pack. You do not have to follow these quests, but if you do, you are rewarded with coins and reputation you can use to obtain rare materials and items only available in the Quest Tablet. This guidebook will help explain all the changes in the mod pack and will be updated every new version. Oh, that's pretty nice. 
So we get click a topic to jump to the page. We have major changes, contract guide, B is for big fix, and answer witty title. Huh, okay, let's go to contract guide. A major part of the ferret business is the quest tablet, assisting those back home not only with research, but productions. Some of the best items in the pack are only obtainable by completing quests, filling contracts, it should be fulfilling contracts, and obtaining enough re reputation to earn the right to purchase them. Contracts are repeatable quests that require either a mass or basic resource supply, or the, con the construction of a factory to produce the complex items production in large quantities. Crafting empty slot cranes. You fill contracts by combining various productions, products, or research resources with an unfilled shipping crate, which can be crafted by surrounding a silver coin with an any wood planks. You get 64 of them for just that. As you complete the contracts, you earn coins, which can be used to purchase supplies and reputation, which earns you bigger contracts and special rewards. That's it? Oh, okay. Oh, 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 what's all this here now? Hold on. Uh, important information, please read all the text, including the text in, to the right. Okay. Uh, magical crops are only obtainable through the corporate shop in the quest tablet. Recipes have been disabled. Squid spawns have been disabled due to vanilla bug that would cause thousands of spawns at once. Oh, I know all about, about that. Ink sacks can be obtained via the, this recipe. Whoa. Okay. Uh, seeds will not spread naturally due to their almost weed-like nature, which can cause lag. Yes, they can. Uh, seeds can be crafted by combining any seed with the appropriate colored dye. Okay, that's I like that. Some mods require wheat seeds only, and with so many other seeds that can be hard to obtain, craft any two seeds with some floral powder from Botanica to get two normal seeds. Okay, that's pretty cool. Alright, well that's nice. That was pretty nice. So when it updates, this book will tell us will tell us what the updates are, so that's pretty awesome. I like that. I like that a lot. I don't see monsters, which is kind of odd. I mean, they're on the map, but I don't see them. See them, you know what I mean? I'm also trying to make sure I keep my... Ooh, there's some light over there. I wonder if that's lava. That'd be cool if it was. So, let me see something here. Let's go to initial research. Do I need to I need to manually submit them? So I don't have any of this in my hands in my inventory right now. That's what it's basically saying. That is correct. I do not have any of it in my inventory. We will change that. And as soon as I get myself Oof, I thought I hit I thought I was gonna hit the ground hard. As soon as I can get myself a piece of gravel. There we go. Alright. And manual submit. Wait, they want five dirt? You bastards. That's fine. Five dirt's easy to get. We can get that easy. Though I... I, I just don't... S okay. I don't know if that skeleton sees me or not. Pretty odd. I've got six, so we can. There's another one. Give me that. Thank you. And bloop. all right. So let's go back to the quest book. Manual submit. So now all we need is sand. We can get that from the shore, which is going to be super easy. Which is over here, I think. Hello, map. Could you update for me? Thank you. Yeah, it's right over there. Which, there aren't any monsters over there. So we might be able to get in and get out real quick. So, I know I'm taking a chance here. But, gotta take a chance. Maybe we'll get rewarded for all our hard work and dedication, huh? 
All right, so we can close this back up. Where the hell is that chicken at? I hear you, chicken. Chicken, you are amazing. I don't know how you're getting in here. I know, you got skill. Wait, hold on. Let's, let me back up real quick. Hold on. Let me see something here. Whoa, what the hell was that? I saw it out of the corner of my eye. That was weird. Alright. What the hell is this? Oh, we got a quick slot. That's cool. So, let's see. Oh, cool! We can get pets and minions. That's awesome. Oh my god, that's gonna wait. Shut up, chicken. Alright, let's see. What kind of mods do we have in here? We're waiting for daylight anyways, so might as well. Uh, we've got A2. We've got another one bites the dust. What the hell is another one bites the dust? Preferred crush neck. I've never played with that before. Antique Atlas? Ooh. Applied Energistics. Armor's Workshop? Are you kidding me? Wow. I hope that doesn't lag me. Or a Crusade. That's pretty cool. Blood Magic. Blood Magic's in here, and I just heard that chicken pop a egg out of its butt. Chicken, you just popped an egg out of your butt. I know you did. Yes, I know chickens don't pop e eggs out of their butt. But they are, I consider them to have ass bombs. Because that's what I see. I don't like eating eggs. Go to... Yes, I said it. I don't like eating eggs. Okay, so we've got we've got some monsters surrounding us, which is fine. I'm not really worried about that. Because we're pretty safe up here for right now. I'm pretty impressed we found this. Uh, Ender I.O. I love Ender I.O. I don't know what the hell this is. Hmm, okay. Draconic Evolution. Yeah, I've played with that before. Extra trees. We've got extra bees. Awesome. Forbidden Magic is in here? Really? Huh. Man, this thing is jam-packed. Mechanic generators? Wow. This thing is jam- Oh, nether ores. Cool. Mine factory reloaded. Awesome. Project Red. Even better. Thermal expansion. Yes. Oh, Steve's workshop. Oh, this is awesome. Solar flux. Simple jetpacks. Very cool. Random things. I love random things. Random things is the best. Forestry, micro blocks. Oh. Yay! Yay! Oh, what the hell was that? Okay, so they. They're. How strong are you guys? Come here. Oh, no, 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 no. That's a special zombie. No, 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 no. You guys can burn. You guys can burn. Because that's what, exactly what you're going to do. Oh, boy. Okay. Cool. Oh, we need to finish our quest real quick. We need to eat this. Keep our health up. Alright. So we manual submit. When we get all that, we get our apples and claim reward. Alright, this is what I'm interested in. What the hell is heavy? <gasps> Ooh. Wait, hold on. What is this made out of? Oh, it's made out of paper. These cheap El Budos. They make everything out of paper? Okay, so that opened up this one? Uh, okay, so I checked out the soil. Very soily, very good, rich, even. There should probably be plant life around you. Anything resembling a tree. Wait, actually trees. Excellent, excellent. This is great. Go knock one down and make some tools for me. No, no better way to see the quality of the materials you have. In return, I'll send you some spare armor we have. It's kind of more for uh, decoration, but it's better than nothing, right? What kind of people have I gotten? What the hell are wrong with you people? So they want us to make a craft. They want us to make wooden tools, which is fine. That's annoying. Oh, Tinker's Construct is in here. Okay, that's cool. So for now, we'll just put... We'll have Tinker's here. Alright, so we need to make... Make some... Wait, hold on, 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 hold on. What kind of tools did you want us to make again? Um, 
these look like regular wooden tools. Don't screw me over. Alright, don't screw me over here, will ya? Alright, so we got four of those. Let's go ahead and make the sword. Let's see. Let's see. Well, that's annoying. Okay, so it is regular ones. Making sure, because I can get screwed over pretty damn fast. Uh, 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 uh. And remember, we don't need to damage these. If we damage them, they don't turn in as quests. That's how the system works. Accept it and move on. Oh, I'm just getting all kinds of fire hazards going on in here. Alright, should be it. Manual Smith. Oh, I gotta make the damn shovel. <gasps> okay, making the shovel, making the shovel, making the shovel. We're almost through with the episode, guys. And then I'll just start doing some stuff on my own. Making this place a little bit more fancy. Because oh, I'm so fancy. Alright, shovel's done. So we get claim or reward. We can either get silver coin or we can get a helmet. I am going to get the silver coin because I think we're going to need it later down the road. Because they did say we have a shop. Alright. So we need five pieces of cobblestone. We should have this. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Those wood tools aren't the best. Kind of weak. Weak but sturdy. Brittle, serviceable. Let's go with the term. Anyways, I need more samples. Let's get some samples of the local rocks. You might have to dig around in some of the gravel for more samples, too. In return, I'll send you a bit more armor and some food. Huh, okay. So, we'll get trail mix, we'll get cherry soda, and we'll get silver coin. I hate cherry soda. But I guess I'll have to accept whatever they give me. Right, right, okay. So, but since we're, you know, kind of in a, a, a thing here... We need, is it cobblestone that we needed? Make sure, yes, it's cobblestone. All right, so we do need cobblestone. She's not good, because she's not having a lot of cobblestone. Oh God, this pickaxe. Oh boy. Just gonna kinda borrow from our environment. There's five right there. All right, Manuel Smith, we got it. And I'm going to choose the legs because the legs have more um, metal or more ingots there to it. Uh, because if we got Tinker's Construct, I'm going to get a Tinker's Smeltery up. All right, and it's the name of the game. Unlocks 12 quests elsewhere. Okay. Uh, so I analyzed all those rocks and stuff you sent me. I found traces of metal. Lots of metal. Lots and lots of different metals. Metals are useful. You can make better tools and probably better armor and stuff too. If you get me samples of the ores and you show me you can make some good tools with them, I'll give you an in I'll give you intel access to the corporate shop, as well as a couple of things to help you defend yourself with. Sound good? Many resources like the the like in entire tree trunks and veins of ore can be mined in a single go by sneaking when you're breaking them with the appropriate tool. So vein miner must be on here. Wood tunk base. What the hell is that? Edger tunk kit manual. Basic trunk tunk trunk base crank. And a disposable item turret? What? Okay, that's interesting. Did it open up anything else? Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. What is this? Requires one and one. Wait a minute. Locked quest requires one and one quest to be completed elsewhere. Okay. And we don't have any contracts. Okay. Well, it's not been very exciting, I know. But we did learn a lot of new things. Uh, apparently, the company we work for is... Uh, douches so that's always awesome and then let's leave you with the view of the ocean how about that that way you can come back and enjoy what we've done so there we go here we go a view of the ocean oh, is that oil over there damn a lot of stuff around here anyways guys thanks so much for watching likes comments great appreciate it as always we do this for fun 
not for profit. Yes, the few episodes, these first few episodes are gonna be kind of, kind of like meh. Uh, but you know, accept it. It's, you know, it's how we start off. Everybody always complains that nobody gets to see how people start off. So, yeah, yeah. Anyways, uh, so what's gonna be done while off camera? Well, I'm going to tighten up the place, make the place look a little good. Go downstairs to the first level of the dungeon, see how that looks. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and get some trees cutting going on, get some farming done, and some mining done, and then um, come back. So, this has been the blind let's play of the ferret business, and I hope you enjoyed. Talk to you later. Bye bye.